West Arena was sold out again today. South Dakota State wins its sixth straight game in the WNIT, 82 to 50 over Seton Hall, and the Jackrabbits bring home the tournament title. We have a great group, and we just wanted to keep playing with each other as much as possible. Um, so, you know, April 2nd, this is the last day that we could be playing, and we're playing, we won, so that's what we wanted to do. To come out with the championship is amazing. I wouldn't want to be anywhere else than right here. I don't know how to put it into words, but this is such a cool experience, such a special environment. Jackrabbit Nation always shows up, but especially tonight, especially throughout this whole postseason run, and uh, so it's just awesome to be a part of this. So exciting. To be able to do this in front of Frost is unbelievable. Maya, the first thing she said after we didn't get in was, let's go win it, and to do that here is just so amazing. You know, you just feel so happy that that group of seniors got a chance to have not just this game and the championship, but these last several games at home. You could just see the connection between them and their, and their families and the university and everything just really come together in a special way that people will remember for a long time. So feel really happy for those four, but also for the entire group. What a fun year. Played great today. Just really excited they're going to get a chance to enjoy this. You know, we've had a really good stretch here, so we want to just keep doing what we're doing, stick to the game plan, move the ball, and give Seton Hall a lot of credit. They're a great basketball program, and it was an honor to play against them in this championship game. Yeah, we just said to ourselves that we've stuck together all year, we've executed our plan, and today is just a day where you have to go out, execute all the details, um, don't change anything we've been doing, because that's the reason why we got here. So that's what we did, and you could tell we were just laser focused from the start. Yeah, I think we came out right away through our first punch and um, kind of never looked back, but we were ready for it. This is something we've worked all year for and uh, really happy that it all came together. Sure, we knew it was going to be a tough game, so we just came out ready. Um, we were told to crash the boards, could get some awards, and that happened, and um, we just found the right people, and it worked out for us. We played great. You know, we really focused on not only trying to execute and play, but really trying to lift each other up. We, we really talked about that idea, and I think we've done a great job of that in March. When something doesn't go well, the team is doing a great job of picking each other up and making them the best version of themselves. And honestly, I think that was really the difference for us.